So for today's lesson, we'll start by reviewing fractions. A fraction is a representation of a part of a whole. So for example, this fraction that's shown on the screen is two fourths. Our numerator is two, there are two pieces that are colored, and our denominator is four. There are four total pieces of our pie. When we talk about fractions, if they are proper, they're always less than one. So then what about this fraction? When we look at this one, there's one whole pie colored in and a piece of another pie. So how do we write this? What, what is this that we're seeing? So there are two different ways that we can represent this fraction. The first thing we can talk about is how many selected pieces there are. So if we look at this, we see that there are one, two, three, four selected pieces. So that would mean that our numerator would have to be four. And when we talk about our denominator, that's how many pieces of the pie there are. How many pieces in each pie? There's one, two, three. So that would mean that my denominator needs to be three. This is what we call an improper fraction. It's improper because the numerator is four, which is larger than our denominator, which is only three. And so when we see a fraction where there's more pieces colored than, than there are pie pieces, it's what we call an improper fraction. But this can also be represented as a mixed number. So what that means is we're gonna show the full pie as a whole number and then just write the remaining pieces as a fraction. So when we look at this, we see that there is one full pie. So in our whole number box, we're just gonna write a one because we have one whole number, one whole pie. And then if we look at our second pie there that's only partially colored, we have one piece that's colored, right? Out of three possible pieces. Did you notice that our denominator is the same between an improper fraction and a mixed number? It's always the same as the total number of pieces in each pie. That denominator doesn't change regardless of whether it's written as an improper fraction or a mixed number. So let's look at this one. If you were going to write this particular fraction as an improper fraction, you would write five fourths because there are one, two, three, four, five shaded pieces, and each pie has one, two, three, four. So that's our denominator, the total pieces of our pie, and five is the number that's shaded. So if we were representing this as a mixed number, we would write it as one and one quarter. Notice again, the denominator stays the same. We have one full pie and one out of four pieces shaded in the second pie. 